Okay guys, before I start, I would just like to say please excuse any background noises that you might hear. Okay, so this is the Oru kayak, all folded up. As you can see, it does not look like a kayak in its folded up form. It's very easy to lift and very portable, which is one of the best things about this foldable kayak. You can take it anywhere, you can lift it. It's unbelievably light. This is nice for teenagers like me, especially because if I wanna go kayaking, I can just put it in the back of my car. I don't even have to worry about hitching it up to the the outside of my car I can just set it in the back seat this comes with the kayak obviously but it also comes with a paddle the seat which also folds up and a life jacket that comes in different sizes to fit whatever size you are but we're gonna start with the kayak okay so this is Oru kayaks lake kayak in the color black my dad also has the Oru kayak lake pro kayak so if you guys want to see a review on that and an unboxing with everything with that Go ahead and check out his channel. I'll have the link in the description down below. Also, me and my dad used this kayak yesterday, so I, we've already unboxed it, we've already used it. But if you guys do wanna see an unboxing, again, go ahead and check out my dad's channel. Without further ado, let's get this baby set up. First thing you do, there's these little clasps on the front that you're just gonna unhook and it automatically just pops out like this. Then you're gonna unfold the top of it and unfold the stern. And you can already see that it's starting to look more like a kayak as we're unfolding it. Once we have the kayak all unfolded, it's time to put in the seat, which again is all folded up. So we can just take it out just like this. And we're just gonna place it in the boat, facing the front, obviously, just like that. And then when you're aligning the seat with the inside of the kayak, this little dent should match up with this little crease and the same thing on that other side over there. The dent lines up with the crease. We're gonna start at the back of the kayak and you, there's these little lines that you just kind of have to pop in, push together. And then you buckle and pull. And then this little buckle at the back hooks so this one that's kind of underneath in the back, buckle that, pull it tight. Super duper easy. And there's the exact same thing over here. Okay, now we have both the stern and the top of the kayak all put together and we're basically all set up. The last thing we have to do is buckle the back of the chair. So we're just gonna take this buckle and this buckle that is both behind the chair, clasp them together and pull it tight. And then for the chair, you have adjustable buckles as well. So you buckle this and there's the exact same thing over here. And then this way you can loosen it or you can loosen it or tighten it depending on how far forward and backward that you want the seat at. Believe it or not guys, that is all you have to do to put this kayak together. There are little buckles here, but this is just for putting the kayak away. So you can either leave them outside of there like this or you can pull them, set them in. But other than that, all the buckles are all clasped together. Okay, now I'm gonna show you guys how you put together the paddle. Comes in four parts. You have two connecting pieces and then your two paddles, one will say Oru and one will say kayak. First thing you're gonna do is you're gonna take one paddle piece and one connecting piece, push in the little button, put it in. Right there, the button should stick out and then it's not moving anywhere. Then you're just gonna do the exact same thing with the other paddle. Perfect. Now you have two pieces and you're going to stick up the little knob right there, match it up and slide it together. Just like that. And then this knob, you're just gonna push it down and it's all connected. And you might have to adjust it a little bit back and forth to make sure that the paddles are all even and lined up. But other than that, you're all done putting together the paddles. Last thing we would have to do is put on our life jacket for safety. Always remember that if you're in a big body of water and you're kayaking, 
you should always wear a life jacket just in case something were to happen and you fall in. The nice thing about these is that they're adjustable. So they have adjustable shoulders and adjustable sides so that you put it on, buckle the bottom, zip it up. Then you're gonna adjust the sides and pull them as tight as you can get them. And then you can adjust the shoulders. You always want your life jacket to be as low on your body as possible. So that's why we adjusted the bottom first. But now we're all set to go and that was really quick and easy as well. And it's as simple and easy as that. Now you're ready to sit down in your kayak with your life jacket and your paddle and start kayaking. Okay, let's say you're all done kayaking and you're ready to put everything away. Let's go. I'm gonna start with taking off my life jacket just because I think that's gonna be the easiest thing. Paddle, unlock, take apart. Pushing the button to take out both sides. All done. And these do have a bag to put it in as well. Now to put away the kayak. First thing you're gonna do is just unbuckle everything. So there's two on the back, one for the seat, and two on the front. And then you can just push out the sides so you can get the chair out. Just like that. And like I previously mentioned earlier, the chair folds up too. So you fold the chair, then fold the other side, lock it together. Okay, now to fold up the rest of the kayak. First, you're gonna fold down the back. And you remember those little fold folding tabs that we folded down earlier? You're just gonna push that in, flatten it all out, and press it on the ground. Same thing with the front. You're gonna have to push in the sides to make sure it's flat and set it down. Now we're ready to fold it up. So you set up one side, set up the other side, and then you're gonna use those buckles, lock them in, pull, lock them in, pull, and then there's a little handle that you're ready to pick it up, and walk to your car. Okay guys, that is it for today's Oru kayak setup and takedown video with all the accessories along with it. After using this kayak in the water, I can tell you that it is absolutely amazing. There are very few differences between this and an actual hard plastic kayak that most people have. This is much easier for transporting with its very light weight and small suitcase form that it has. If you guys wanna see more videos with me using it in the water, as long as videos on my dad's channel using his kayak which is basically the same thing with just a few enhancements and upgrades then subscribe to my channel to see mine and then subscribe to his which again will be in the description down below and also i will be linking oru's link to their website down in the description below so you guys can get yourself one of these kayaks and trust me when i say that you will absolutely love it thank you guys for watching i'll see you in the next video bye